All right, Zach, thanks so much. Let's get to your local news headlines this morning. Aquila ISD has announced they'll be shutting down today and tomorrow due to a spike in COVID cases. The district says there was an influx of positive cases among students and that all district events will be canceled for the next two days. So far, there's no other information at this time. This morning, Connolly ISD students are headed back to school after the sudden and tragic passing of two middle school teachers due to COVID-19. And as they do so, masks will be required for all students and staff on what will be undoubtedly a very hard day for everyone in the district. That's where we find our own Texas Today's Barry Roy with more. Good morning to you, Barry. Yeah, good morning to both of you. Connolly ISD really finds themselves in a position right now where no other school district would want to find themselves, especially over the course of the last two weeks. Two teachers at the junior high level died of COVID-19, followed by an explosion of new cases, and finally a district-wide shutdown of campuses. Now, with students return to in-person classes this morning, they will do so with a mask mandate in place for all students and staff. The district also held a two-day COVID-19 testing event over 600 people were tested and 16.3% were positive for COVID-19, most of them being asymptomatic. District officials said the start of the new school year was supposed to be a celebration of returning to classes, but acknowledge how devastating things have become just a couple weeks in. It's very disheartening uh, as far as at this point, everybody was really looking forward to coming back to school and having the kids face to face and being able to interact. Um, and then just how quickly the tide turned. The district says they are now turning their attention to wearing masks and sanitation, asking everyone to be as vigilant as possible moving forward. Connolly ISD will uh, host a free vaccination clinic on Monday, September 13th from 5.30 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. That will take place in the high school gymnasium. Kristen Tahesha, I am told that Superintendent Wesley Holt, he plans to be on all district campuses today, making his way, talking to teachers, talking to students, and making sure that he he is there for them as they transition back into in person uh, learning after a very difficult last two weeks. Reporting live outside Connolly ISD, Barry Roy, 6 News. All right, Barry, thanks so much. Meanwhile, more schools across Central Texas are mandating masks for anyone on campus. McGregor ISD announced all students and staff will be required to wear masks in school and on buses. That's effective immediately. And River Valley Intermediate of Midway ISD will be requiring them for the next two weeks. In a video newsletter, the principal says the campus will reevaluate COVID protocols after September 17th.